When you call 911 in an emergency, you expect help to arrive. One Youngstown man talked to First News after waiting an hour for an ambulance, but it never came. 27 First News reporter Amanda Smith investigates and uncovers what might have gone wrong. It was right here on Jefferson Street that a victim of crime called for help that never came. Well, you do have a 55 coming, correct? That's from a living call. Frank Karcher was assaulted by his girlfriend on December 6th. Police reports show the woman attacked him with a knife and beat him with a pipe. She pushed me down the steps, took a big CP past pipes and started you know, hitting me. I told him I'm bleeding. Police arrested Aurora Black on charges of felonious assault. They called for an ambulance for Karcher. It never arrived. Police officer tried to say, you send an ambulance? And I'm still waiting and waiting. I got real mad, so I won't want to my own cell. Rural Metro has the contract with the city to answer all medical emergency calls. They have to answer or face financial consequences. There are times, as there are with us, with police, any safety, that all your resources, the moons collide and you're just tied up. The fire chief says their track record is good. You have to respond 90% of the time within eight minutes. So that's the standard met. I don't think they've ever failed. I called Rural Metro when I first read this report. I left another message today. We are still waiting for their response. In Youngstown, Amanda Smith, 27 Investigates.